UEA Ballroom and Latin Dance Club has given me the opportunity to learn 12 ballroom and Latin dances and to compete these dances from beginner level upwards at many competitions throughout the year. This includes the InterVarsity Dance Championships, which are held in Blackpool. I've also been given the opportunity to perform at dance shows, including UEA Strictly, which UEA BLDC hosts every year. My favourite sporting memory from my time at UEA was in first year. This was Derby Day 2019. I enjoyed supporting all of the sports teams at this event and celebrating UEA's win afterwards. With my remaining time at UEA, I'm really looking forward to being on BLDC committee this year and organising UEA Strictly. I'm also looking forward to expanding my dance knowledge and improving my dance skills, as well as attending more competitions. There are many benefits to joining a sports club. The first is that you get to make friends outside of your course group and you get a sense of a team spirit and being a part of a team. Secondly, sport is really good for your mental health and gives you a real break from university stresses. As well as this, it improves your fitness too. You also get the chance to compete in your sport against other universities, which again gives a sense of team spirit. And you also can be on committee where you can gain valuable life skills. It doesn't matter how much experience you have or what your fitness level is, um, sports clubs are inclusive to everybody. If you aren't sure if a sport's for you, there are many free taster sessions and they are held throughout the year so you can go along and try out your sport. Um, obviously you get the opportunity to compete, but if that's not for you, then you don't have to compete at all. Um, and you can go and support your team just as a spectator if you want that like team feel and I would highly recommend that. If face-to-face -face teaching is allowed, then we'll do face-to-face -to -face teaching with as much distancing as possible. Socials will be held like this too if we're allowed to do so. Um, if couples dancing is allowed by government guidelines, then we'll be allowed to have one partner that you can practice with as a couple. Um, but if we're not allowed to meet and do face-to-face -face teaching, then we'll do virtual online classes and socials will be held that way too.